Sorry, Snoopy. You can't go with us. Dogs aren't allowed on the school bus. Woof. G'day guys, welcome to the vlog. I'm not sure exactly what time it is. It's probably like noon, about 12 o'clock. And I thought I'd get out and uh, walk Suey. Suey's girl. Doggy, come on. But I haven't walked Susie in a long time, so it's good to get out, just have a walk through the town. It's a little bit chilly at the moment. Once we get going, I think we should be fine though. But I have been working on the eBay and Etsy, just been listing some items this morning. Also have some a lot of items to ship out, so I'm gonna be doing that soon. When I finish with the walk, I probably should have got everything ready and then walk to the post office, but when I finish with the walk, I'm gonna go back home, package up some items, get them shipped out. It is Monday today, so there's quite a lot of items that need to get shipped out from the weekend. So we'll get those done, and then I'm just gonna keep listing. List, 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 get heaps of items up. It has been quite a while since walking past this part of town. There used to be like one house here, now it's been taken down and it's separated, so they're gonna turn that into two blocks. Everywhere I walk, it just looks so different. So I made it back home. Post office is gonna close in an hour and 15 minutes, so I need to get my shipment out for today. I think I sold maybe six or seven items, so let's get those out. So the first item I'm sending out is this Breville coffee grinder. This sold for like 20 bucks, nothing much. The model is CG12. Um, yeah, this is just one of mum's items that I'm selling for her. So there's 20 bucks. Works out to be like 16 profit or something like that. Then this one here is the RM Williams vintage coat jacket that I sold. I sold this one for $75 and I paid 20 bucks for it. Don't you just love it when they make boxes perfectly for the items that you want to sell? That fits nicely. That goes in there. The next item I sold was this Sony Walkman. This was the WM FX30. I paid five bucks for this one and it sold for 40 bucks. And don't you just love it again when they make boxes perfect for your items? I bloody love it. The other item I just sold was a t-shirt of mine. It's just a color gray size medium shirt. That sold for 10 bucks. I paid, I can't remember like four dollars from the thrift for it plus I got heaps of use out of it so that just sold for ten this was in one of my recent videos it sold for forty three dollars this Richie's cycling jersey and I paid two dollars fifty for this one from memory and the last item I'm shipping out today are these rusty pants these again are just my mum's one of my mum's old pants they sold they sold for like 15 bucks. I'm making my way down to the post office and I put some pants on because I heard it raining outside. I must have just missed it. The sun's just come out now, but it was raining pretty hard while I was getting the packages ready to be shipped out. So I just got back home from going to the post office, got everything sent out, but as soon as I got back, I just realized I sold something else. So I'm gonna head back out to the post office again, get this one item that I sold and ship it out. It's an international sale. It's going to Israel. I've never sold anything to Israel before. Very strange. I guess it's not strange, it's just unusual. I've never sold anything to that part of the world, but if they buy it, and I send it, we're both happy, so why not, right? I'm just driving back down to the post office this time because I have not long at all and I just wanna make sure I get there in time. But I didn't show you guys what I just sold and packaged up. It was one of the broken cameras from the bike tour. It was the silver cannon that uh, broke when I was in Japan. So I just sold that for parts, faulty, not working. I got like 30 bucks for it and I paid $10 for it too and I got some really good use out of it. And the person who bought it was from Israel, so they're gonna pay like 35 bucks postage. So they paid like a total of $70 for this camera when it sells for like 100 bucks in its working condition and, it, and the thing doesn't work. 
So um, I'm not sure what's going on there. So here's the package and there's the post office. Just finishing up the vlog. What I'm doing right now is just doing some research and just making a list of the thrift stores that I want to hit up tomorrow. I've got about 20 on the list, but a fully packed day of thrifting consists of about 30 thrift stores, 25 to 30 thrift stores from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Going hard at it all day. So I just got to build the list up a bit more and look for a few more op shops that I haven't been to in a while. And hit them up and hopefully we'll make some money but that's it for today's video thank you for watching if you enjoyed it make sure you give me the good old thumbs up and also drop a comment down below and i'll see you guys in the next one bye